merhaba bikum. Hello everybody, welcome today. So this week is actually a very special week for us. We're traveling here to Fez, Morocco to visit Lukman's family. Um, so we're really excited to bring you a recipe um, from Fez and we'll be cooking in his sister's kitchen today, which is wonderful. So stay tuned, we're going to make a version of baba ganoush or eggplant with some tomatoes, some garlic, some spices. It's gonna be really great, so stay tuned and we'll get started. Right. So this dish actually in Morocco is called zalouk. So many places know it as baba ganoush. Um, in the, the States, we just know it as like a, an eggplant dish, I think, but uh, here in Morocco, yes, it's called zalouk. So uh, we're gonna make that today. I'm really excited because we're cooking with my friend Malika. Um, so, Ana Farhana Bizef hates Liuma Khantaib Ana O Malika. So, Merhaba, Shukran Khati, and Yala, Nimshio. When we're making our Zalouk, um, we'll see here that Malika is brushing the eggplant with oil. So we'll first roast these eggplant and the oil here just gives everything a really nice roast, a nice crispness. Okay, great. So we're also going to be roasting our uh, green pepper and our spicy pepper. So this is like an Anaheim pepper we're using and also a serrano or a jalapeno, something to give it a little bit of a spice but we'll be roasting again our eggplants, our peppers, and yeah. So again, in our last video, we kind of showed you this technique of squishing your tomato using a cheese grater. So we're doing that same technique here, but we're using the small um, part of the the grater. So we used about seven or eight small eggplants or I would say two or three um, larger eggplants and we're using four tomatoes, four medium tomatoes here. We're using a bit of parsley, again some garlic and then we'll be using some spices and after we roast this eggplant, then what we're doing is actually taking the eggplant out from the skin. We're adding it in this pot, this pan here with the tomato, um, the rest of the ingredients, some more spices, and then we'll cook it down. Okay, cool. So we're actually using here a morcajeta again, but a, a, a mortar and stone stone and pestle, something that you can smash your parsley and your garlic with. So she's cutting it into some pieces to help it and then she's going to uh, add in the garlic and smash it to create kind of like a paste and that is what's going to go in with the tomatoes, with the roasted eggplant, um, with the rest of the spices. And she's using about four or five garlic, so himsa, arba himsa tuma. Uh, and about, I would say, a quarter cup of parsley, maybe a little bit less. Skoma khuti fad hazar sahit alimna bshay min haja kan sabuz aluk tuka kul shi. Ma yana wili na had gin. انتم اخوتي الطريقه ديال زعلوك يا هادي وبالموسيقى راه كت ترين ترين موسيقى جيد ان ذيس كو ان ذيس وي ستيت ات هوم سو لونغ ناو وي نو هاو تو كوك يو نو اوكي جريت سو وير ويتينغ until our eggplant and our peppers look like this. Now we're gonna go ahead and peel this stuff. Ah, haka. So we're peeling, as you can see, just the skin off of the eggplant. Again, we want the inside, we don't want the skin. Be careful, because it might be hot. <laughs> One. 
ما انتي اه فسي 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 ان فسيه فسيه she is from fez so she is from the town that we're in right now same as lukman بهل هل هل so now we peel the peppers the same way هذه ففله اندريجه شنو شنو هذه اندريجه انجل 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 هذه هذه ففله مناف شنو هذه فلفل حارة فلفل حارة فلفل حارة فلفل Adian in Saubo la sauce. Adiel Matesha. Yalla. In bed, Matrena Dinjel Flal Ferran. Jbidna Mokshernaum, so Bnala sauce deal deal Dinjel. Adin Sobo yellow long tongue for Had Dinjel. Great. So we're going to add our spices into our sauce. Um, I will tell you the names of the spices in Darija. And Malika is going to tell you the names of the spices in English. So it's a great little sharing opportunity here. So we're using milha, we're using kamun, we're using libzar, and hadi is tahamra, o fifilla hamra. salt. Papirk, black pepper, cumin. Okay, so now we're making the sauce. As you see, she poured, we have our spices with our tomatoes. Now she's adding the parsley and the garlic um, and about two teaspoons of olive oil. So all these ingredients together, she'll go ahead and put on the stove and begin to make the sauce. Great, so yeah, you see here she has the heat on high as she's cooking the sauce down a bit. Um, and this will remove a little bit of the liquid so it becomes a little bit thicker. And then, yeah, we're going to cut up our eggplant and our peppers, and then we'll add that into the same pan and, and we'll have our lovely zaluk. Yeah, <laughs> Now she goes ahead and puts our eggplant into the sauce. Okay, so we're cooking this all, the sauce and the eggplant, for about 15 minutes, um, but continue to move it. Uh, it's on a pretty high flame, so we want it to cook, but we don't want it to burn. So just continue to mix it around and let all the spices, the oil, the eggplants, garlic, everything mix together. Shukran khuti khwatati. We're super excited to eat our zaluk today and a big thank you to Malika, shukran uh, This is so nice, so we're really excited to try it, and we hope you guys make it at home. Um, if you're Moroccan and you have other Moroccan recipes, please share them with us in the comments below. We would love to give them a shot. And if you haven't already, feel free to like and subscribe. Click the little bell below to get more notifications from us. And um, yeah, we hope to see you guys soon. We'll see you next week for some more videos, inshallah. And yeah, have a wonderful day. Ah, Unta Lokman.
Mzi, Zuin. Ah, Mzi, 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 Mzi,